Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, then make sure to subscribe and also follow me on my Instagram. Today's video is a very special video and it's one of the most bougie videos I've ever done. It is review video of a Lancome skincare range and it is the Lancome Absolute range. Now the Lancome Absolute range is one of the most expensive skincares in the world. Now the Absolute range is phenomenal and it has phenomenal reviews on the website so um, I was really really interested to test them out and I had my chance to test out three products from the absolute range which I'm really excited and I want to show you my personal experience by using these products now the whole absolute range from Lancome has the amazing three rose extracts which is blended in, in all the products the first rose is called the Lancome rose now this Lancome rose is the most standard rose in the Lancome family it's coming from all the way from Loire Valley I hope I pronounced correctly it is from central France and the Lancome rose has been used in many years and it only produces 1000 roses each year so it is a very limited very like hard to find rose in the Lancome products and also it has been used in the Lancome products in many years so you it is one of the most signature scents that you will find in the Lancome products so in most skincare products and a majority makeup products such as lipsticks and face powders and the two other roses are the rose Damascena and the Centophilia Rose. The Centophilia Rose is a very common rose, a very nice rose, smells amazingly and very fruity, very floral and it's such an amazing uplifting rose. So these three roses are the three rose extracts which are blended in into the Absolute range from Lancome. Let's start off things with the cleanser. So this one is the Lancome Absolute Gel Cleanser. Now on the website I have my phone in here, it says that it's a cleansing foam I think they've got the description a little bit wrong because it's not a foam, it is a cleansing gel. So the texture is very, a little bit liquidy and very like light, lightweight liquid of a gel consistency. So it's uh, very nice and the ingredients of this has a lot of ingredients now. I mean obviously the rose extracts are blended in here and uh, one thing I've seen in this ingredient list from Lancome, it has a lot of alcohol that's the only downside but some other good ingredients that is inside the thing is coconut oil and um, avocado oil it has glycerin which is okay not the best but uh, glycerin you'll find the majority skincare products so that's fine but the main thing I would say it has coconut oil and the rose extracts but and also got um, salicylic acid. So salicylic acid is also good for acne prone skin and for blemished skin. So it really cleanses the skin, which is really good. So the liquidy uh, consistency is very liquidy. The way I like to use this is I obviously I wet my face and I put a little bit dots in here and then I just washed off like in a circular motions. Once it gets contact with water, it gets like lightly cleansing milk so it's not like foam basically how the website says the milk is very nice and very nourishing and what also good is it gently removes my skin and uh, it does really removes all the sweat and all the pollution which has happening and built up from my skin it refines the skin texture and makes a nice clarified skin complexion overall after I wash it off. The good thing about this cleansing gel I've noticed is once I've washed it off, my skin was very clean, very fresh, very pure, refreshed, refined, and it was very serious. So this was a really good cleanser overall. But the only downside, again, I must say, is the row, since it has the three roses, it is very heavy on fragrance. Now, if you're not a rose fragrance type of a person, you won't like this. And this little bad boy retails for £67, which is quite pricey for a cleanser, but uh, it is the more a luxury cleanser and it has low of ingredients of the roses inside. And it is 125ml, which is 4.2 fluid ounces. The next product on my list, I have the Absolute Rich Cream. Now the Rich Cream is one of their creams that is in the absolute range they also have a soft cream but i have the rich cream now the rich cream you can imagine is very rich on texture 
very nourishing and uh, this makes the skin feel softer and it renews my skin cells which I have noticed and it makes my skin very subtle very comfortable on the face it doesn't make my skin very red which I really like now the consistency is very thick very rich as you can imagine it has like a pinkish undertone which is quite nice and it smells very I don't know, very rosy, very like expensive, very luxurious, very spa-like if you can imagine. I've been using this cream for day and night and it is a day and night moisturizer that you can use. And um, the way they said it, use it as, as a upward uh, motion. So use it like this to really like rejuvenate the skin and make your skin very tight. Since it is more like an anti-aging cream, the whole absolute range is an anti-aging cream. I forgot to mention this. but um, this one is really good. What I found with this moisturizer is it really, really promotes my skin and really gives the skin like a new renewal and makes the skin surface like a more new lift, basically. Basically, perfect throughout the day and night. I, to be honest, I really, really like this. It sunk to my skin very quickly and very nicely. And um, again, with the smell, if you're not a rose person, you won't like the smell because it is very heavy on fragrance and speaking of the ingredients uh, it has the three rose extra it has the glycerin it has loads of alcohol again and another thing i saw in the ingredients list that it has is it has the alcohol and it has again the coconut oil which has the gel cleanser as well and it has a lot of perfume and fragrance. I found that this would be perfect for dry and sensitive skin and I do have dry skin so this worked out perfectly for me and this bad boy retails for 133 pounds. <laughs> 133 pounds is quite expensive and you will only get 60 ml so 60 ml for 133 pounds so if you have the cash and the money and if you're looking for a new uh, moisturizer then check this one out and last we are talking about the Lancome Absolute Revitalizing Eye Cream now the eye cream is especially targeted for the anti-aging wrinkles that you might have. This eye cream has a lot of science behind it, so it's specially made for the anti-aging, so there's loads of hydration and loads of nourishment, which is perfectly for underneath the eyes. The way I use this eye cream is it's day and night, so I like to take a little bit with my ring finger and just pat it onto my eyes and just really nourish it and give like the skin a nice boost and also I like to massage it as well to give like an extra hydration layer. It helps to brighten up the underneath the eyes and also helps to get rid of the tired the eyes that you might have and it literally contours the eyes. It makes it more smoother, it will get rid of the wrinkles and it just makes the appearance of the wrinkles more reduced and your skin is more revitalized at the whole idea of the absolute range basically. Speaking to the ingredients now that again it has the three rose extracts which is the main uh, ingredients in this range and also it has rose oil which is quite good and it has corn oil and coconut oil as well as loads of alcohol which I think is not that great. It also has apricot oil. Apricot oil again is there for the nourishment on the skin and lastly but not least loads of perfume and fragrance. Again if you're not a fan of perfume and fragrance, then this might be not the one for you. This bad boy retails for £102. Oh my god. £102 for a 20ml size. So, to be honest, you don't get a lot. 20ml is a standard size actually for an eye cream, but for £102, I think it's quite expensive, quite pricey. But again, the ingredients are very rich and very like concentrated and very high on oil so hence why the price really adds up on the product so basically the whole range is more for the anti-aging skin if you see that your skin is aging a little bit then definitely check this one out if you are in the market to splurge some money onto your new skincare definitely check these ones out and also if you're curious how to use these products really perfectly and step by step there is a a tutorial and also like loads of videos and pictures a step-by-step -step guide on the Lanco website for you 
to do the skincare routine in order to really fulfill and accomplish the task i'm gonna leave a link down below for you to check it out it is very helpful so if you have these products definitely check out the website in order to do the right stuff because if you spend that much money on a product you want to make sure that you use it perfectly in order to get perfect results overall i actually really like these products i'm a fan of rose i don't mind the rose scent uh, the rose hand really calms my down and I feel like I'm on a spa and it's very luxurious, very nice to have like rose scented things on your face. I love the rose scent but if you don't like the rose scent then this might not be the one for you. Um, there are other plenty of Lancome products and there are Lancome products of skincare that are really good and really phenomenal in terms of the things that they do so definitely check them out on the website as well while you're on the website you'll find all of the lancome skincare products and also you will find the lancome products and many other retailers so definitely check that out if you're interested and do let me know how you get on and also do let me know if you have any type of lancome products that you like to use thanks for watching and that's it with this video until next time i'll see you in the next one